Okay guys, so what you're looking at is the result of my scrapping off of 23 hard drives last week and these are the aluminium casings which the motors sat in, spun around etc etc. But this isn't the only copper inside this motor and you're missing out on free copper. Whoa. So do you want to find out where it is? Stick around. So guys, we've took out the motor in the middle and there's a magnetic band on the inside. And if you look carefully, I don't know if the camera is going to show it up, but there's the aluminium and there's a steel outer band which runs all the way around. So you need, first things first, you need to remove that band. So guys, a bit of BFI, brute force and ignorance, and you'll soon have it off. Grip the outside with a pair of big pliers like these things on the left. Some snips on that band, give it a pull. So once you got that band off guys, you're one step nearer to making this pure aluminium. So to get the copper in the middle guys, we simply have to put it in a vise and bash it through. Okay guys, so I've just set it up in a vise, centre punch on the top, bit of a persuasive tap. And Bob's your uncle. So I'll just fish that from under there. Oh, come here. Okay guys, and this is what you pop out. So on the end, there's a nice little piece of brass, little brass bush, copper bush and a stainless steel pin. Now it's not much guys, but it's lurking away there. If you spend an extra couple of minutes, you'll get it out. What I will point out guys, is not every motor is the same. Some of them have this stainless steel bush stroke bearing affair. So it's hit and miss, but if you want to maximize every little bit of copper and brass out of these motors, well, you need to do a little bit of micro scrapping. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz, and I'll see you on the next one.